Our coastline here in Cape Breton is an unkept beauty and people don't tamper with it too much. It's just left in its most pure state. And same with the music. It too is very organic in how it is learned and how it is passed on. The comment I most often get is, we're going to Cape Breton, what should we do? What should we see? And so I always direct them to a square dance in West Mabu or any of the square dances. As long as they get a square dance in, that's really important. I think that's the highlight. And I can remember the most awesome house parties and the music would go on far into the night. I remember falling asleep in a corner, you know, and you'd feel the vibration of the stomp of the foot from the fiddler and you'd hear the tunes just wafting through the air and I used to be so comforted by that sound. My name is Natalie McMaster. I'm from Troy, Cape Breton Island.